car van. What are you doing? <laughs> All right then. Yeah, but what's going on? I don't know if you can notice, but if you look on the side right here, I painted my helmet a little bit. I have my helmet set up exactly how I want it. Okay, minus and want a reflective uh, shield. Other than that, I'm, I got it all done. I even put my cat ears back on top of the helmet. And if you want to take a look, here it is, right at you. actually enjoying it and I've had that plan for months literally months I always I was gonna I said that the next time I redo my helmet this is what I'm gonna do exactly right here and I even upgraded the ears the ears come off I'm having a very hard time finding these ears anywhere Walmart didn't have them a Target Spencer's Hot Topic I mean, I've gone everywhere all throughout Waco trying to find these little cat ears, but I, it was all failure. I even went to a uh, adult store, you know, sex shop kind of place, and I figured, you know, they had to have some kinky cat ears in there, but they didn't. I was forced to rip them off my old helmet. And I got it off. I got them off pretty relatively undamaged, but I didn't want to go through this again. So I went around. I went to a uh, fabric store, and they gave me some Velcro, and bam! Industrial industrial Vel Velcro cut them out right on the ears. Now I have. I can take these little cat ears off anytime I feel like. Baby on board. Bam! Oh shit! I ran into you because I was reading your stupid little sign. It was like an epic quest to try to find some new cat ears that I could never find. I'm gonna go get me an iced coffee from Common Grounds. I'm gonna treat myself because I'm in a really good mood with my new and improved helmet. Well, I don't know if it's improved. Probably not. I probably just messed up some of the performers with these cat ears in the paint. <laughs> Oh well, I don't care. My helmet. I'll do what I want. <laughs> Something I found out was that there's a motorcycle get-together that happens here in Waco, like, every Friday. They said it started out with just a couple of people, and it's grown in numbers. I think they're up to 30 people now, 40 people, I don't know, something like that. I mean, not everybody goes there, but every single week, but there's a, there a nice couple of... Ooh, here we go. There's a nice couple of bikes out there. And it's like everybody was welcome. I had there the cruiser guys, Harley, sports bike, Boosas, Groms. It was it was pretty cool. Pretty 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 cool. <laughs> okay, now how do I go through here and drive through? I mean Maybe I need to go this way? Oh, shoot, I have no idea. They're on tonight, I'll be going to that. I'll I don't know if I'll put this, put that in this video or another, now nah, I'll probably do that in another video, so. Plus, I don't know if they want their information uh, broadcast to the whole world. But I'll find out tonight, I'll probably, I'll make that another video. Oh, that was a good coffee. Oh, man. It was sweet. If you're ever here at the Baylor place, if you go to the common grounds, get something called a noble. It is amazing if you like sweet. <laughs> oh, you know what? I want to visit the bear if it's still here. I don't know if it's still here. It should be here. I'm, I'm in the little spots for all this stuff. It has to be around here somewhere. I'm going to go look for that bear. Baylor has a real, or at least they used to, they have a real 
bear in a cage. Okay, I can't find it. I'm gonna have to go home and look this information up on exactly where it is. Oh well, I just wanted to show off my new helmet. So I will talk to you guys later. Have a nice day, ride safe.